Here I am with Angelo State softball head coach Travis Scott. How what how important was it today to get these two wins? Well, it's always nice to come out and play well and and to come out and swing the bats the way we did on a very cold day uh, is something that I'm very excited about. Our kids didn't walk into the batter's box timid, which sometimes can happen when it's this cold. You're worried about getting jammed and and uh, stinging your hands a little bit. But we came out and swung it, and and uh, it's a fun day considering the elements. Um, how does this do for y'all's confidence? How does this help y'all's confidence? Well, I think it obviously helps to go out and, and you know, nearly run rule twice uh, a quality opponent in Central Oklahoma. But uh, we knew we were fine the whole time, even though we went one and two. We played well. We just didn't pitch very well uh, in certain spots. But uh, we got an offensive team, and, and everybody knows that they got a chance to play. And, and, uh, and we're just excited about getting back on the field. And, and we get a good opportunity to play a lot, hopefully, this weekend. And, uh, you know, we got Laredo uh, in Texas a and International on Tuesday, and then hopefully get uh, six games in up at Durant uh, next weekend. And how are y'all going to prepare for those games? Not much. <laughs> We're going to come out tomorrow a little bit and just uh, try to go out and get in the cages uh, out at the indoor facility and then get in the weight room. And then really it's travel Monday. and. Uh, travel Thursday, so we're going to be on the road more than we are. It's, it's this is the kind of day you want as an athlete. Uh, there's going to be one practice and and a lot of games. Yeah. Well, y'all played great today. Congratulations and happy birthday. Yeah, thank you. Go get that cake and punch. <laughs> we'll see with Angela State softball shortstop Chelsea Walters. How did you feel you did today? Um, I think everyone performed well today. I think that everyone kind of held up to the standards that they were being put at, and I think that. I played well. I mean, I hit well, and it's cold out here, and so it's really good that we were able to come out here and play as well as we did with the weather. You didn't start out as well as y'all wanted to last weekend, so was it good to come out for your home opener and get two big wins? Definitely. It's always good. Um, we always want to perform for our fans. We have a lot of people that come out and watch us. We had a lot of people here today, and it's 40 degrees, and so we want to come out and perform for our fans and play the best of our abilities, and I, this should be a confident booster. How'd that home run feel? It was good. I mean, last year I only had one home run. My freshman year I hit four. So it's good. Just improving every year, though. Yeah, we got to get yeah. better. Well, thank you very much. Great Thanks. game. Hey, now with Mary Keaton McKay, uh, the pitcher who had 10 strikeouts today. How do you feel about that? Feels pretty good. It feels good to come out and get two wins on a home on our home field with the community support that we had. So it feels good. Feels good coming off these two wins. I saw all those nice handshakes with your team and Elsa throwing the ball up. What kind of camaraderie is that? How does that feel for you? It feels awesome. To, I mean, these girls are we're a family, and so to come out here and be able to laugh and to have fun that makes it even better. Well, you played awesome, so that makes it easy. <laughs> Congratulations, girl. With Angela State softball player and catcher Casey Easley, how do you think you did today? Um, I think as a whole, we looked really well. We hit the ball pretty hard and we came out really aggressive but also really patient at the plate so I think it was two big wins for us today. How important was that after last weekend's not so great start? Um, last weekend we still we were came out pretty confident last weekend and lost a couple of heartbreakers late in the game so um, today for us to come back and bounce back and really play well today I think it was big. What are y'all gonna do to improve this week? Y'all play on the 14th what are y'all gonna do? Um, I think we've just got a couple days of practice and we're on the road again so we're just gonna you know just work on the fundamentals and stay true to our game and get back on the road and hopefully go get a bunch of wins this week.